Hey guys, welcome back to Startup Central. Today we are going to be discussing a number of projects that are airdropping in the coming weeks and also some new projects that are actually proposing new campaigns so you can farm them and eventually get airdropped. So if that is something that interests you, like this video and let's get started. Okay, guys, so uh, I've got news for you. We are going to be discussing today ZK Sync, Owl2, Nexto, Linea, and Sanctum. So uh, let's start from the beginning. I'm going to share my browser uh, with you so we can follow along as per usual. So, first things first, ZK Sync, this is one of the big ones, guys, for this cycle. And, uh, you know, funny enough, there has been a lot of rumors of them doing the airdrop this month including some messages that they have posted on Twitter and in their Discord channels. But today we got confirmation because Qcoin has announced the pre-trading of ZK, their token. So what information does Qcoin provide us? They will start um, the pre-sale today. So this is the June 6th and they don't uh, tell us exactly when this is going to be finishing. But normally they pre-sale about a week or a week and a half before the token is generated and of course it's launched. So if you have been farming ZK Sync and if you have been following this channel, you probably have. Uh, we're about to get compensated for our efforts. Now uh, there's still a couple of things that you can do if you think you can qualify. We don't know if this snapshot has been taken. We don't know if this is going to be a multi-season airdrop, but I think that there's a couple of things that you can do that are really inexpensive uh, in order to get the most out of this airdrop. Now, before we get there, I want to show you because how much would each of these tokens be worth? Well, this is kind of Wales market in, in the case of Qcoin, it works kind of a similar way. It currently is trading for around uh, almost a little bit under a dollar per token. So we will see, we don't know how many tokens we will be getting uh, airdropped, but now I'm going to show you what you can do. And by doing this other thing, uh, you will qualify for two airdrops uh, for the price of one. And this is OWL2. We have been discussing this bridge uh, for a while. This is one of the best bridges in my experience uh, and one of the most recently priced. So if you have been trying uh, other ones like D Bridge and Jumper and all these other bridges that are going to be airdropping soon, uh, OWL2 is one of the most inexpensive ways to move your funds from one L2 to the other and even from different L1s. Uh, I like them. Normally you can even do uh, testnet bridging. So uh, this is uh, one thing you want to know. You get points, as you can see here, for every time you bridge. But there's also other activities that you can do in order to qualify for more points and, of course, for a larger airdrop. Now, I don't personally believe this is going to be the largest airdrop. Of course, nothing compared to ZK Sync. However, guys, bridging is an essential part of airdrop farming in these cycles because we need to move funds from L2 to L2. So, um, you might as well use this one. As you can see, I've got a crude uh, number of points. They have tiers and they've mentioned that uh, the higher tier, the highest tier is, is a lot of points. I don't know how many, I remember how much that was, but it was like 10,000 points. The next tier is from 2,000 points to around 10,000. So I'm in that second tier. And the last tier is for a, a lot less points. So uh, they have not announced yet when they are going to be airdropping. So you still have time to do this, to use this protocol. And again, this is a cheaper, one of the cheapest ways to move your funds from chain to chain. But here's another thing, and this is the one thing I want to show you that uh, is going to be very inexpensive and it will add transactions to uh, different chains. So uh, you can do this once per day. And I already discussed this in another video, but I want to remind you because it's important. So uh, in here, you can click every day and um, get some points. In here, as you can see, I got two points. I got two more here, but you can cho choose the chain and they have all these chains that you can do this uh, in. And one of them is ZK Sync. So I already did the scroll one because I did some ZK Sync transactions today, but it doesn't hurt to add transactions to scroll and it's going to cost you about 10 cents of a dollar each time you do this. Plus you get more points in uh, this bridge. And once you get more points, if you do bridge, 
you are going to multiply those points, the bridging points. So that's how I've gotten to uh, almost 6,000 points. So um, again, uh, it's cheap. It's uh, something you can do every day. So it's easy to remember uh, that you need to do this and get more transactions in different chains. Now, uh, as a reminder, it's just once per day that you can do this. So uh, you need to think which airdrops have you been farming the less and uh, this is kind of a maintenance thing. Um, so now let's move to OWL2. They have uh, mentioned that their first snapshot is scheduled for Q3 2024. So if uh, you are interested in farming this one, uh, then you still have a lot of time. We're still not in Q3 and uh, you can get more points. Now let's go to the next. Uh, this is not actually a chain. It's a centralized exchange i know people are wary of all these places centralized places where you can get interest on your tokens however this is the one that uh, persisted for the last cycle uh, and that is already talking good about them and their business plan now they are going to be uh, distributing around a little bit over 14 million dollars to people who farm this campaign all you have to do is create your next account if you don't have one verify so this might not be for everyone but um and do some transactions and then you will be getting points now they are clear about how many points you get for everything that you can do in nexo so you can top up assets you will get 0 0.01 points top up uh, bitcoin you will get this amount of points 0 0.001 buy crypto this is a good exchange guys uh, it's and you actually get some of your um, funds back every time you trade so it's really cool you don't have to pay gas transactions and uh, you could actually just deposit you do your exchange and get your funds out if that's something that you want to do or leave your tokens there and accrue some interest and the interest rates are really interesting now a lot of people are wary of celsius and all these places that went down in the last cycle so it's up to you guys but you can just farm this, get your funds out, and just try to get the airdrop. Um, successful verification will get you the amount, the most amount of points, which is 10 points. Um, and there's a lot of things. So you can just go uh, check this page and read and see what you can do to get uh, part of this airdrop, which is, it's a nice airdrop. It's 15 around, at the current price of each Nexo, it's around $17 million. I don't think there's going to be a lot of people farming this. So it's a good opportunity to get an interesting amount of cash. Now let's go to the next piece of news, with, which is Sanctum. And um, it's uh, actually not a piece of news that they are publishing, but I did notice today that the points have stopped. Uh, I have two different accounts, two different wallets with Sanctum. And if you can see, after getting a two X points yesterday they all stopped now they have announced new um new <laughs> they call them pets it's one of these thingies so they have announced new ones so i don't know if they stop all of this so they can bring in new lsts and you can get new pets so what i did yesterday i tried to get into as many as i could as you can see i still miss a number of them uh, and I see some that I haven't even seen before. But right now, you are not accruing any points. So they did make that announcement in their Twitter account. I'm going to show you. And we're here. They're talking about different LST, even the Cloud token, which is the Sanctum token. So they have announced their um, tokenomics. So this means we are close, potentially, to their airdrop. Now, they have announced other LSTs like Kumasol, uh, Exol and all this. So, in my opinion, there's going to be a season two with new pets. So, whatever you got yesterday potentially is going to be a snapshot for this uh, token that has been announced just yesterday. So, let's move with the next piece of news. And this is Layer Zero. Layer Zero has uh, kind of announced that they will be airdropping soon and uh, they haven't announced whether there has been a snapshot yet so in my opinion there's still time to get some transactions and qualify for a larger airdrop they uh, stargate which is kind of the main protocol of layer zero 
has created a version 2. So it says Stargate 2 is now live and there's an opportunity for you to get more transactions. Now, there might be, because uh, that's invoked these days, uh, more seasons because they don't want people just to get claim their airdrop and just move away and ignore the protocols forever. So most protocols are doing different seasons. So it doesn't hurt to push some transactions with uh, version two. They might be getting you a bigger airdrop for season one, or you might be starting to earn some points for season two. Um, I think this was um, enough for today. I have more news. I'm going to make a different video because I don't want to overwhelm you with information. So you can actually take action and uh, start doing all of this uh, actions so get, you get more of an airdrop right after this video. But before that we go, guys, don't forget that we have a Twitter page. So I will encourage you sometimes I get news, I share them on Twitter and I don't have time to make a video. So uh, when that happens, I share this news on my Twitter account. It's down in the description of these videos along with the links to all of these pages. So I hope that this video was useful to you. I hope you are getting big airdrops and I'm going to again publish a new, a new video. I don't know if today or tomorrow because there's more news for airdrops and uh, some of them are interesting because you are getting some points, LXPs, and actually you can claim some of this stuff. So uh, expect the next video. If you have not subscribed to Startup Central, do so now so you can get those videos as soon as they're published. Hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.